to 8279 Northwest 89th Place, located in Lower Bridges States. This 8.18 acre parcel sits right above the Deschutes River, has Cascade Mountain views from Bachelor all the way to Mount Hood at the north. That's Mount Hood straight ahead. And so in order from north to south we have Mount Hood, Olali Butte is that little hump straight ahead just to the north of Jefferson that's right behind Green Ridge. And then we have Three Finger Jack, Black Butte, Mount Washington, the Three Sisters, Broken Top, and then Bachelor's hiding behind that tree, but you can see it from multiple locations. And you look across all those cool ag irrigated fields. The river. And within this neighborhood, there's amazing access to the Deschutes River from about four different locations. You can walk right down, mountain bike, and then float all the way from at the end of 84th Court down along this stretch of river. You can float to Lower Bridge, leave a vehicle, and uh, so you just hop in, float down to your vehicle, and then drive back. It's really a nice way to enjoy the Deschutes. It's great fishing, and at the end of Teeter Avenue, you'll see a video snippet I'm going to add that'll show the access on that side to the Deschutes. And there's also a video at the end of 84th down where you can walk to the river and bike down to the river. The lot's fully flat on the buildable portion above. It has septic feasibility for a cap and fill septic. Well depths are in the three to 400 range, so affordable. Power is ready to be connected to. And you own the land beneath this parcel all the way down to the next lot. That's below touching the next road. So nobody's going to build right beneath. All of this land below the rim is part of the parcel all the way down to this next street. And those home sites where you see homes built are the last of those that will be built on this side of the river. Just a beautiful parcel, panoramic views second to none in a neighborhood that's close to town, less than 10 minutes into Terrebonne, 15 minutes into Redmond, 20 minutes to Sisters, 30 minutes to Bend, 20 minutes to the Redmond Airport. The central location with paved streets and access to everything is just second to none. out here on the edge of the Deschutes River. So I access this property on my mountain bike by coming straight east at the end of Teeter Road across BLM land. This is totally allowable for mountain bike and hiking, all kinds of recreation. You can get down to the river for fishing. Excellent pools down here for rainbows. And there's others too that people love to fly fish from here. There's Mount Hood in the distance. This BLM goes all the way to the end of the peninsula here. There's Mount Jefferson. And the BLM stretches then even on the other side of the river, all the way over to where you can see that little bit of smoke coming up. And a lot of that is ATV and UTV terrain, but it's across the river. Everything on this side of the river is non-motorized. So just hiking and mountain biking, things like that. It's quick access from the lot, and it's quick access from anywhere in the neighborhood. 
Just beautiful terrain, very serene, a great place to come out and just enjoy nature. You can see the Ochikos way out there to the east, behind Smith Rock and Grey Butte. There's Smith Rock and all of the Grey Butte area, just past Terrebonne. Standing on the bank of the Deschutes River, directly below the end of 84th Court, at the end of the Deschutes County Park Reserve land, on the BLM land that adjoins it, there's excellent access for fishing down here, just enjoying yourself on the river, and also floating on inner tubes. You can put in the water right here from about mid-May through mid-September when the water is nice and warm and float down to Lower Bridge with a vehicle waiting and just walk down the hill. It's a short walk from the end of 84th Court down here with your tubes. Put in the water and float for about an hour and a half. It's serene. You see river otters, deer, all kinds of different birds and there's wild irises that bloom along the edge of the river. All kinds of other neat things too that are just really pretty all throughout the growing season. Just a neat spot to take in the central Oregon outdoors.